It's one of the largest icebergs in Antarctica, and scientists say it seems ready for a change of scenery. In the recent years, so since around 2020, we first started to see it moving a little bit, uh, and now it's uh, moving relatively quickly up the eastern side of the Antarctic Peninsula and out into the open ocean. It will be hard to miss, as it's said to be three times the size of New York City. Researchers say it broke free in August 1986 and hasn't drifted too far away from the shelf it came from. But now they say it's really on the move. Where it was grounded quite close to the continent, the ocean is very cold. It has moved around a little bit, but over time it's probably just thinned slightly and just got that little bit of extra buoyancy that's allowed it to lift off the ocean floor uh, and get pushed by the ocean currents. Scientists say they will be watching it closely, and while they say it will decrease in size as it enters warmer waters, it's still a cause for concern, especially for the shipping industry. For Inside Edition Digital, I'm Mara Montalbano.